Sodium Chloride, a new weapon in the fight against cancer? Introduction Sodium Chloride, commonly known as salt, is an essential nutrient that has been used for centuries to preserve food and enhance flavor. However, in recent years, salt has been linked to a number of health problems, including high blood pressure and heart disease. As a result, many people have reduced their salt intake, and some have even eliminated it from their diet altogether. New research findings however, a new study suggests that salt may actually have some health benefits, particularly in the context of cancer therapy. The study, which was published in the journal Nature Immunology, found that sodium ions can increase the efficiency of anti-tumoral T-cells. T-cells are a type of white blood cell that plays a critical role in the immune response to cancer. The researchers found that breast cancer tumors have a higher sodium concentration than healthy tissue and that T-cells act particularly strongly against tumors when the immediate environment has a higher sodium concentration. These patients then even have a longer survival time. We were able to show that sodium enhances the immune response of CD8 T cells, says Cheng Feng Chu, who is a first author of the study. CD8 T cells are immune cells that can recognize and kill tumor cells or cells infected with viruses in the body. Previous research has already shown that sodium regulates other types of T cells involved in autoimmune diseases and allergies. We wanted to find out what effect sodium has specifically on the activity of human CD8 T cells, explains Sean Sun, another first author. Possible mechanisms The researchers used various technologies to investigate the effect of sodium ions on gene regulation and the metabolic process of CD8 T cells. They found that the salt improved the metabolic fitness of the CD8 T cells by increasing the uptake of sugar and amino acids and thus energy production in the cells. As a result, the immune cells were better able to eliminate tumor cells, as the experiments on cell cultures and mice have shown. Pancreatic tumors shrank in the mice after we injected them with T cells pre-treated with salt, says Chu. The researchers believe that sodium ions increase the activity of the sodium-potassium pump on the cell membrane of T-cells. This leads to a change in the membrane potential, which in turn increases the activation of the T-cell receptor. This signal amplification makes it easier for the immune cells to kill tumor cells more efficiently, says Sun. The salt also protects the T-cells from becoming exhausted too quickly. This is important because exhausted T cells gradually lose their ability to fight cancer cells. Implications for cancer therapy The findings of this study have important implications for cancer therapy. They suggest that sodium chloride could be used to improve the effectiveness of adoptive T cell therapy, a type of cancer treatment that involves modifying the patient's own T cells to recognize and attack cancer cells. Our findings suggest that sodium chloride could be used as a positive regulator for the killer function of T cells in the future, says Chu. This is not about patients consuming more salt in their diet. Rather, it is conceivable that the immune cells are exposed to an increased salt concentration outside the body and become highly active against tumor cells after being administered to the patients. Conclusion The study's findings suggest that sodium chloride may have some health benefits, particularly in the context of cancer therapy. Further research is needed to confirm these findings and to elucidate the mechanisms by which sodium chloride may improve the effectiveness of T-cell therapy.